green light and we're set for a start mix four and five stand by set and away, Black in Parlor a touch slow from the outside and out fast, Dinah Yeza straight out to lead, Ryko Ablett to second and Black in Parlor loops the field to third. They're followed then by Dinah Carney, go seek Fernando to the outside, Wumpf of Dinah Uni and last Connor Allen down the back and Ryko Ablett let go. Goes up to challenge Dinah Yeza who now boots back on the rail. Black in Parlor a length away and Dinah Carney's letting go three and four wide but it's still Dinah Yeza defies them for home, a length and a half, Ryko Ablett Ablett, then Black Impala, but it's Dinah Yeza clear, kept on going, rolls all of the way. Dinah Yeza from start to finish, won it by a length, Black Impala, third Dinah Carney, and then Ryko Ablett, followed by Go Seek Fernando, Dinah Uni, then Wumpf, and one of the last, Connor Allen. Time here, 34 and 22. First out, first home in race number seven. It's coast to coast from Dinah Yeza, number two. Andrea Daly, the winning trainer, was able to hold the challenge of Ryko Ablett, who made a, a mid-race move to level up to Dinah Yeza, who just had the strength, was responsive in front, and has eventually drawn clear to win race number seven. Number two, daughter of Kelso's Fusilier, Zylia Allen, prepared by Andrea Daly at Anarchy. Second, number seven, Black Impala, George Borg, Cosmic Rumble, Proven Impala, and the one-third, Dinah Carney, Kelso's Fusilier, Zylia Allen for Brendan Wheeler and Andrea Daly. So she's only had four runs back from her spell, Dinah Yeza, but that's been a smart performance tonight. She grounded out really well, coast to coast, all of the way, and uh, she lands race number seven on the program. So tote divvies, we'll have in just a moment, 2715, and the totes filtering through race number seven. Totes are up.